what is going on everyone welcome back to my channel my name is basil today i am back with another photoshop tutorial a while ago sebastian requested in his comment that how to edit like shevchenko photo he is russian i don't know how to pronounce it so based on sebastian's request today we are going to create that video i would like to hear more requests like this so before any further ado let's get started make his account and you can see his photos are attractive and they have a minimalistic color grading as you can see in all his photos we have a bronze brown skin tone you can achieve bronze skin tone in your photos with many methods today we are going to do this in post processing using photoshop Photoshop and import your image. You can use this image if you want. I leave a link down below to download this image. Create a copy of background layer. Press Ctrl plus J to create a copy and create another copy. Uh, so I am going to desaturate the image. I don't want the. Uh, I am going to reduce the saturation in the background. So go to go to image adjustment hue and saturation. We have blue in the background, so we are going to reduce that. Reduce the blues and the cyan's. Reduce the saturation of the blue and cyan's, and increase the lightness to make it brighter. And adjust the hue if you want. I want to retain the blues in the nail polish, so I'm going to create a new copy of Layer Edit. And paint over the uh, mask with the blacks. And paint over the mask with the blacks to retain the original blues in the nail polish. Leave the edit behind as a backup and merge the two layers together. You can see the before and after. Next, press Ctrl plus J to create a new copy. Create two new copies and name in the first layer to Dodge and Burn. Press Ctrl plus Shift U to make uh, to desaturate the layer. Then change the blending mode to Vivid Light. Then go to Filter and apply High Pass Filter at radius thousand maximum you can. Create a mask and fill it with black using the using the fill tool. Then go to brush and change the color to white and paint it over wherever you want to make dodge and burn. Play with the brush and create a perfect dodge and burn. Use blacks to remove and whites to add adjust the opacity to make it perfect Now I'm going to merge all the layers together except the background, uh, original background layer. 